Hi everyone, my name is Ruth and for today's video I am going to get this Aura Estelle set up for the winter holidays and um, everything that I use will be from one shop. I will try and keep it from one shop. There will be things that I have to take in from other shops but um the majority is from the DEK design shop like the papers and all the deco all the you'll see um so yeah uh I'm gonna try and keep this as simple as I can this is going to be a set up with me kind of video so yeah let's get to it so this is an Aura Estelle A5 Cloud Planner, uh, wide, and um, I don't know what the name of this color is, but um, it's that pink, which has like a little silver tone, and this is how it looks like inside. I'm trying to see if I can uh, have it all in frame. So this right here is really not important. I use it as a... Um, I, I use it here so the papers don't get, um, how do you say, um, like, uh, creased up. So I keep it here so it can maintain its straightness. So I do have, um, well, not really. I have one thing in here and that's really just for like page flags and stuff like that. And um, so yeah, we're going to get to it. This section will be the first section right here. And this right here is basically, once you open it, it's like a dashboard. Um, there's these two pockets individually. You have this big pocket and this one. And then you have obviously a little window there. So I... Have, I try to keep everything organized as I'm going to put it in. I already have practiced, so so I don't make this video as long as I it doesn't have to. So, <clears throat> first thing will be the die cuts. Die cuts are from the shop. So, they're not in the shop physically because these usually come in the sub boxes. So, if you want themed die cuts, definitely subscribe to the DEK Design sub box, which ships out monthly and just in time for you to set up whatever you want to set up. So it's all themed winter, Christmas, holidays, um, you know, it's all themed. So you'll have so much to choose from. You'll also have papers, which I'm going to show off in a little bit as well. So for the die cuts, this die cut, I want to put it somewhere. I'm just not sure where. So I'm going to just push that to the side. So this right here says ready to build my empire. And as you can see, it's from the planner press. And I just needed something that is going going to motivate me throughout the entire year because yes this is a winter but i wanted to switch over as much as i switch over um everything here then i have another die cut here but this one will be like at the very end it says let us know i act put a punch through it um not very good but it's okay so we're going to start setting up. I have a bunch of die cuts here and I'm going to start setting up everything for the um for the pockets here. So I'm going to take these the pockets to me before I move on. The pockets to me are going to be for deco and for um little quotes and stuff like that. I don't want to put anything other than that in it. So I'm going to take these die cuts right here and this one's going to go not all the way, but like halfway. Same thing with this one and then this one, since it's so perfect, 
I'm going to leave it right there in the middle. So next up is going to be this piece of paper that came in the box as well. I'm not sure which boxes, so I'm just going to say that everything you're going to see ranges from the November and December boxes. So this is from one of those boxes. I'm sorry, I'm not as detailed. This is my first time doing this, and this is my first Aura Estelle. So that's pretty there. Um, I might as well put this other one in there. This is another one. Um, as you can see, it has a little slit in it, and it's because it's um, one of the um, papers that um, the bows because in the boxes you get a special bow. So one of the bows came clipped onto that. So I have this other um, quote from Aura Estelle. Not from Aura Estelle, sorry. I have this other quote from the Planner Press. And it says, if the plan doesn't work, change the plan, but never the goal. So this is another one which is neutral, has black and white lettering, and it will fit perfectly in here as it will when I change the setup to any other type of setup. So then the last two die cuts that I'm gonna be putting here are this one that says Mary and this beautiful rose. And I feel like the rose should go there halfway and Mary should come here. Mm, maybe I'm gonna switch it. Just so you can see Mary a little bit better. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to end that section right there. I'm not going to continue because as I, I want this planner to grow as I go. So I'm pretty sure there's going to be nice papers that I can put in that will go perfectly fine in here and in here, you know, like a little peekaboo. So, oh yeah, um, before I move on, I did want to add a bow, which I think is perfect. This is the bow that came in the box as well from the DEK Design Shop. And I want to see if it, I don't want to mess up the flow, but Perfect. So that is the first half. So on to getting these um, papers in. I have all the papers um, sectioned off. So I was going to start from back to front, but I'll just start from front to back so I can just... So... I'm going to tell you that every every insert is from Jacenia Printables. I get a lot of questions from where my um, printables are from. And they are all... I haven't tried many other shops. Um, I did try um, Annie's Printables. I think that's what it's called. Yeah, I think it is. Annie's Printables. And they definitely... Well, she definitely has... Um, really really good printables that really match my style like the Jacenia printables do so I definitely switch up between those two but for this planner right now every printable is definitely from Jacenia printables so this right here is acetate with snowflakes and this is going to be the first of my of my um planner once you enter i like to do lots and lots of layering this is why i i love the deco and the decorational part of it but um 
I am also, you know, it's also my planner. So something that I'm going to be seeing every day, I might as well have it cute and functional. Okay, so I think I'm going to start showing off section by section. So the first section is going to be the dashboard. So I'm going to take this out really quick. And then I'm going to show you the dashboard and how I layer it. And then it's going to be the inbox. So this is the dashboard, which is going to be layered with this acetate that I just showed you. I hope you can see the detail. So this is from the planner press. It is a printable, so I got it immediately and I printed it out on regular white cardstock. And it's the winter essentials, which you got snowy trees, candles, cozy fire, fuzzy sweaters, winter drinks, winter lipstick, warm boots, cute hats, and of course, snow. So that's going to be the first thing that's going to go in. Wait, I should definitely do it on this side. Then the next thing is also from the planner press. Um, these are dividers, which are they fit perfectly and they are for A5 cloud wide i keep forgetting to say wide this is an a5 wide cloud so um these are um the snow no um oh my god i forgot what they're called but it's um it's the one that's like uh frosted there you go frosted so it's frosted so you can see kind of through it but not completely which i really 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 like so as you can see the first um, section in my planner is going to be the inbox section. These are also from her shop and I chose the Harry Potter um, type of um, lettering because I had to throw in some Harry Potter. So the first section is all about my inbox which I will include lists and things like that. So the first part and this is where I'm saying that this is um this is where all the cute stuff is going to be from. This is from, this paper is from the DEK Designs um, sub box. This is also from the sub box. This is a notepad. And this also came, this, this pouch also came in the um, sub box. So these right here are die cuts that I used. Sorry, they weren't coming out. Those are die cuts that I use just to just so it so could look nice. So what I really really want to do is have half of it in and half of it out, so it looks like that. And I'll just put the die cuts in the half that's in. Now this might not be you know everyone's cup of tea having die cuts and everything together, but. I think it's cute and it doesn't really bother me. So these are washi, little washi tape stack and a cute little pen, which something similar came in a previous box. So that's really cute. So I'm going to do that, close it. And then here is the back of that paper, which is super cute, very winter. Christmas type which I love so for my inbox I want to keep everything as organized as I can and I love these these inserts from the Jacenia printable shop because they are in sections so I'm gonna show you and I'll put that one in there and then I'm gonna show you this so they come in sections right there so I can divide my list so I can put um mornings, afternoons, evenings, or I can have weekly, monthly, or um, groceries, or workouts, um, fitness plan, fitness routine, meal prep, things like that. 
it's basically like a brain dump. So anything that I am thinking, I can just dump it into those lists. Okay, so next is the shopping section. I had to put a shopping section because I do a lot of sticker shopping and I definitely like to have everything under control and also um, not just stickers, but um, you know, the holiday shopping that I have to do, presents, things like that. So, I would love to tell you where these um, acetates and um, vellum come from, but the shop has closed down and I've had these for many years. So it's kind of pointless and I'm so sorry. I know these are so cute and I wish I they the shop is still open because it was it was a really good faith of mine. So this one says let us know it's acid it's a vellum and it's on white. It looks like white. I, I want to say foil, but I don't know if this if, if this counts as foil. But I hope you can see that. But it says, let us know. And I'm going to put that in there. And then I'm going to show you this, um, my um, shopping inserts. So these came also from the Jessenia printable shop. It has a monthly section. Oh, let me just show you the front as well. So these are special for the holidays, which she did. And like I said, it has a monthly section, so the month of December. And then you have you have all that. So you have travel info, state info notes, travel plans, and then it has the packing list. And um, in all different categories, like she thought of everything, which is perfect. Then you have notes. So this is all perfect for all of that. We got that whole note section. I have the other half, which it has the list section. But since I already have, I feel like this one is good enough for me. I'll probably put the list one in there. So, okay. So I, oh, I do have the list section. It's coming up. So to divide this section and that section, but to keep it in the shopping section, I took this vellum, which has stockings, and I, and I uh, layered it with this paper, which is from the DEK Design Shop. Look at the back. Beautiful. And it flows perfectly with the next principle so the next principle has the same basic cover but this one is all about the weekly plan and I think it has the list oh no it doesn't but this is basically the weekly plan but you can make list on it. It is gridded paper, which I love. And um, yeah, there's a mistake there. And um, of course you have habits and all that stuff that you can track. I like to put um, things that trigger me because the holidays can be stressful. So that, another thing, fun fact, is um, I don't think that is in uh, A5 wide in the shop. Or when I bought it, it wasn't. And I had to try and trim it down to an A5 wide. That's why you see a little bit of um, excess on it. Excess. So next up is this other paper. Which I placed right there. And then I have this other paper. I'm probably going to do something in between these two. But I'm not too sure right now. So that's why I have 
paper on top of paper. I can actually put anything. Um, probably like a like a card or something there. So this next paper is blank. It has nothing. Here's the back of it, but I had to have this section right here. And I used, I don't know if you can see that, it says ideas. I used tap tape from the shop. And it says ideas. And then uh, let me show you the tap tape before I move on. So these are tap tapes. Um, these are from the first shipment. And then she did have another set, which was like black and white, which came out for Black Friday. But um, those are the tap tapes and um, they're perfect for me to create even more sections in between sections. And as you can see, I placed it on top so I can see it from, a view, from the top view instead of on the side because the side view would have been covered by the actual um, divider. So I got this, it's just, it's just notes. It's like notebook paper. I got that from the Just Send Your Printable shop and basically I can do anything and everything. I wanna get this foiled, but um, I don't have a foiling machine. So it's pretty sucks, but Eventually, I'll get one and start foiling everything. <laughs> but um, so these are just basically another brain dump section, as you can see. Um, it's just paper, and I'm just going to dump any ideas that I need, like ideas for, um, for my boss or anything like that that come to mind. So I have that's that section, and then... Let me see, do I have another section between the section? Yes, I do. Okay, so here is vellum. This vellum is actually from the shop, from the DEK Design Shop, and it um, comes in the box. So in the box, you get paper, and you get one vellum paper. So this paper, I paired it up with this one right here, which I feel goes perfect. And then you have the back, that's the back. So I'm gonna put that there. And then this one says projects. So this is gonna be my project section. And I also got um, inserts from the Jacenio Principal Shop. These are not in A5 wide, these are actually just in A5. So I had to cut it down to a5 wide and that's why you're gonna see some like you're gonna see the mark the marks which don't bother me I can always white it out so these this is called the release tracker so basically any projects from of my for myself or any projects for um, the shop or anything like that will come in here I haven't wrote anything in it for the purpose of this um, of this video because you know I don't want to I wanted to show off the insert and how it looks like instead of not being able to show it off so it's pretty functional I love it <clears throat> sorry about that Next is this paper, and this paper is just basically ending that section, and it has that in the back, and this gorgeous little wreath in the front. So next up, we have the monthly section, and this is when this um, planner starts getting more functional for the new for the new year. So I actually am doing something very different this time and I am going to place this acetate and it has a gold sparkle foil and it says kiss me at midnight which is perfect for the new year and I actually placed it in front of this um, section, section 
and it's the monthly section. So this is basically going to be the monthly, the year at a glance, and well, I didn't want to put the year at a glance, but since, why not? I feel like it'll be perfect. If anything, I'll change it, but it really is not bothering me. So I wanted this to flow, so that's why. I, I technically see the year at a glance, then the month. So this is functional. Um, this is the year at a glance for 2021. It's very simple. And you have the first half and then you have the second half. And next up in this section is this vellum paper, which I am pairing up with my goals section. So I'm gonna, I don't have the monthlies printed out yet. I will get those printed out. But it's gonna be the year at a glance, the monthly section, and then my goals section. So here is the vellum paper. I wanna put it like that so you can see. So that's the vellum paper, and then I'm putting it on top of my inserts, which is the reflections and goals of 2021. This is also from Just Send Your Printables. And I have not written in it for the sake of this video, but it starts off with reflections and it moves into word of the year and you've got gridded paper and then you start getting the monthly sections, which you have to do's and actions to make those to do's. So it makes you complete your goals in a very perfect functional way. So that's that section. Next section is going to be the weekly section. And we're going to start off with this cute paper from the DEK Designs sub box. This I can definitely tell you is from the November sub box. And this is going to have my dailies and my weeklies. Yes, I have two because just because i i have to plan there's just so much stuff to plan i have to have dailies daily goals and then i'll have my weekly overview so my dailies are dutch door style i love the dutch door style and i i have i am super excited that it actually is an um, A5 cloud because I love how wide it is and it has more room than um, I was previously in a, in a B6. No, I was previous. No, yeah, it was a B6. So I was in a B6 and if you have seen, the B6 is way more smaller than the A5. And... Um, there was big, I loved it, but there was just not enough space for me, for everything. So Dutch door is like this. You have this section, and then you have your days of the week in Dutch door version. And then you have the rest of the week. So you'll see it in that way. And then to separate the daily from the weekly, and the weekly I don't have printed out, I got this um, vellum. This vellum is from, I want to say Sadie Stickers, but it might not be, but I think it is. But yeah, it, um, it could be from Sadie Stickers. I got this really quick because she came out with a... Um, collection for the holidays and I fell in love with it and I was like okay I'm buying it but I have been holding it on for I think a year I think this was last year's so then in this section I will have the weekly so next section is all about fitness so I have the fitness section right here and basically, 
this is not all about fitness. It is basically health care, health goals, everything. So I have these, um, I said health care and it's self-care, sorry. So in the Jersenia Printables shop, she did have a self-care um, bundle. And that's what's coming in here along with a bunch of my fitness sections and stuff like that. So right now I have three sections that I printed out from the bundle. And this is the therapy session section. And it's just simply like that. You got, you put the date right here, you got reflections, you got your goals and it continues like that. So I want to say that this is like a monthly or maybe two months in one print. The next section, which I definitely, if I get more paper, because I think I used up all my paper from the boxes, I'm going to, hopefully the next box has something really cute, which definitely always does. But um, I will definitely section this out and I will use my tap tape. And I'll probably use this one right here because it has um, planner goals and just bows and just icons. It really doesn't have that much lettering as the pink one does. So here's the self-love section. And... It basically looks like this. So you got self-care. So you got mind, body, heart, and soul. And you just basically write anything there that you need. And then on the other section is going to be the goals for your personal growth. So basically what I will use it for is goals on this side in a list form. And then here, detail of how I want to execute that. And then we have this section, which is basically daily routine. And here basically is just what do you do before bed? What are you doing during the evening, during the afternoon, during the morning? I like it because it, help, it holds me accountable. And then you have, I don't really want to focus so much on the, on the principles, but yeah. Um, you have this section, which is um, how you feel every month. Every So you have the months right here on the top and the every day of the month. So here you can say, I say, um, use a system. There's a bunch of those um, little dots that um, minimal planners use. And you can take those colors and base those colors off of your, um, off of your mood. So here is the last section, and it's the one line a day section. And like I said, I will probably put a piece of um, decorative paper here and just to um, divide the sections, personal preference. So here is one line a day. So you got the month of, this is basically a 12 month right here. Month, every day, you write one line a day. It could be positive, negative, just depending on how you feel. So that's that. And then I still have to print out the um, meal plan, the fitness regimen, all that good stuff. So it's a lot to do still. But I really wanted to get this video up and ready for you. So I think I'm going to place this cutie right here. It's this right here. It's um, basically a car with the tree on top. I think I'm just going to place it right there. I don't think it should bother. So we'll close that. And as you can see, this is going to stop the pages from creasing. The planner is very chunky already. Oh my God. So yeah, the planner is already very chunky, but and it's going to get chunkier. But what I love is that I still have this section right here, so I can just get anything printed.
print it right here and just shove it right here so I can have that section separated from this section. Just like uh, the B6 rings. So, mm, I definitely am going to put this right here and let it hang just because it just fits perfectly with the Winter Essentials. And, um, okay, I was going to put another, but not really. Okay, so this is it. This is how I had it set up so far. It's very functional. It is very, it's cute. And it's functional and decorative and it's perfect for the winter and upcoming holiday and then it flows into the new year which is perfect for me I'm probably going to change things up a little bit which I obviously have to take some sections out and I probably have to change some of these tabs but the good thing is that the tabs come off very easily so that's pretty fantastic and that is going to be the end of this video oh yeah it is super chunky I'll show you how chunky pretty chunky so um next video setup if you guys liked this video let me know down below because i will do the what's the next holiday Valentine's Day. I will do a Valentine's Day setup and get this all set up with Valentine Deco and sections and all that good stuff. And um, so yeah, let me know down below and um, that video will come to you probably beginning of February, end of January. Um, thank you for staying, watching. I hope you like this video and um, have a great day and bye.